Hello there, and here we are on Frequently Asked Questions. And today, we got a question from Leela Payne. And she says, I am new to mold, so can I ask a few questions, please? What is the best thing to use as a releasing agent for my latex molds? So this can be a bit of a controversial question sometimes. It's obviously commonly agreed that petroleum products affect your latex, and there are certain materials which will affect your latex, your latex molds. And I actually use watered down washing up liquid or watered down dish soap, which obviously contains petroleum products or the byproduct of petroleum products. But I water it down and put it into a spray and spray inside the molds. And that kind of gives you a little bit of a quick and easy solution to make up to use as your um, mold release. And I've had no problems so far by using that. And of course the washing up liquids diluted down. But obviously with all these things like, uh, that's what I use, so use at your own risk. You might have a better way of doing things. Sometimes and often I don't use anything at all. As long as a cast is easy to get out of the mold. I know other people use other recipes like using oils, which do not affect the latex rubber you want to do some research on that topic you might want to pop over to Mr Concrete Artisan's channel to see what he uses for mold release there but like I say I use as a quick remedy just more down washing up liquid and I've had no problems with that so far so that's I do that at my own risk and like I say I've had no problems and if you're very concerned about your molds then obviously look into it in more detail and um, like I say check out Gris's channel, Mr. Concrete Artisan. He'll talk, he he probably has some videos there that he talks about with his mold release agents. I tend to use a mold release agent if the mold's a little bit tight, and if I make a mold up where I should have put a seam into a seam into the mold to make it easier to take out. And there are a couple of tight molds I've got here, so I will use a release agent on that. And like I say, that would be the um, washing up liquid watered down or water down washing up liquid or dish soap another thing keep your molds when you when you're storing your molds I'll put uh, talcum powder in with the molds so they don't go gooey because they, they if you leave them around lying around a little bit too much and if they see the light they can um, go a bit gooey I mean see the light as in like the sunlight not like a god type thing or god type entity or some sort of spiritual thing so there we are. I mean, this video might be updated at some point if I use anything different and um, I'll let everybody know what I use then. But also, if you've got any better alternatives, please let us know and put a comment in the comments below, in the comment section below. So that's it for now. Thanks for watching and see you soon and over and out for now.